72 years. That's a long time. I met Vivian in Cedar Falls, and I didn't know that she didn't know, see me at all. And I became interested in her. Well, she's very kind, very sweet. And she would do anything for me, I think. We pretended that we were not anything. <laughs> we were just plain straight people and never let on that we cared for each other. And uh, because we knew the feeling out there. We knew that people wouldn't approve of us, so we, we just kept very quiet, we were very careful about what we did and what we said. And the hardest part was probably, as she said, when we had to be apart and we had to go to our parents when it was holidays and we wanted to be together on the holidays. We did not talk to people or anything about the subject and no one asked us either but we thought they knew probably what was going on and some were happy, some weren't. I guess at 90 now we don't have to worry about anyone saying anything to us or about us. And so I think that we'll be happy now till the end of our lives. Well, I guess it took this long to get married because we felt that everyone was against us and we did not want to publicize it. And so we just kept it to ourselves. Well, we've learned more about ourselves and how we are, and we feel that God has had a hand in all of this. And after the wedding, I think we probably love each other more than we ever have. We were married always in our hearts.